Hey there, ladies and gentlemen, this is Danger Cell. Welcome to Man of Multiplayer. Today we're going to be taking a look at some gameplay within Hearthstone, Heroes of Warcraft trading card games, Arena Mode. The Arena Mode is a game type where you are given three random heroes and are then given the opportunity to pick cards at random to forge a deck which then you take on other opponents who also randomly forged a deck with a random hero. So let's hop into it. It looks like my choices here are going to be the mage, the priest, and the hunter. Well, I really like the priest, so I'm just going to pick Anduin here, my best friend. And now I'm given a choice. Looks like there's three blue cards here, so it's going to be a tough decision. They're a little bit on the better side. Um, this could be interesting. I think I'll choose this one. Oh, holy smite. But there's also light spawn, who is really good. I think I'm going to have to go with holy smite, though. Circle of healing, really good for priests. Thought Steel. Oh, but Mind Control, too. I'm going to have to go with Thought Steel this time. Uh, tough. I really like... Arkham Square is a one-drop. Oh, no. I am going to take the Northshire Cleric here. Light spawns back, but that stealth jungle panther sounds good too. This could be really good, however, with a few cards that might show up, like inner foil well, inner fire. Not particularly useful for light spawn, but still useful for other cards. Holy Smite again. I've probably got enough spells, but oh well. Ravenhold Assassin, 7-5 Stealth. I think I'll have that then. Oh, Silence is wonderful, but so is Taunt. Okay. So this card is pretty good. I think I'm going to have to start picking up some Taunt here, so Iron for Grizzly is going to be my pick. Northshire Cleric, I've got to have another one. And hope that some of those good cards come back to me. Um, give a friendly minion plus three health, huh? That could be good for me. Chill and Yeti. It's hard to beat that. But Shield Bear is a good taunt. And I do need taunts. Mind Control's back up. It's always good to have that as a trump card. Another Northshire Cleric. I don't think I can sustain that. I could. Having the damage would mean a ton of Holy Smites would just be sweet. I think I'll try that. Why not? What's the worst thing that could happen? Okay. So here we go. This is a tough choice. I've got epic quality here. Shadow form, huh? Molten Giant. I don't really particularly enjoy the giant cards. Doomsayer could be could be a good way out for me if I'm in trouble. But Shadow Form might be a way for me to put the nail in the coffin. Another epic time. Mind games, huh? That one is actually a pretty unique card that I enjoy. You get to pick a random minion from your opponent's deck and throw it onto the battlefield, so that's fun. Wisp, a zero one one drop. But I like draw a card. More taunt, huh? I don't have a lot of big finisher cards here. Or any big cards at all. So I kind of hope some of those show up. Here we go. Booty Bay Bodyguard. One of my favorite cards. 
Hall Light Warden could be so cool. Twilight Drake could be okay if in the right situation. But Sun Fury Protector gives my adjacent minions taunt. How many cards do I have left to pick? Six. Double a minion's health. How many do, do I have any of those yet? Mm, I don't. But Lord of the Arena. They're making it tough on me. This is always a good, nice card to have. There's the double a minion's health again. I only got four cards left. Charge and Divine Shield. Master Swordsmith could really help my characters out, but I don't know if I'll, they'll be up long enough for me to actually use them, so I'm going to go with Argent Commander here. Another Circle of Healing. I could probably actually use the extra... This is basically 5 mana for 2 creatures, which isn't a bad deal at all. I like Circle of Healing, though. Oh well, time to take a risk. Ancient Watcher. Ugh. I'm going to pick him in hopes that he shows up. So now what happens, guys, is that you take your deck and you just challenge other people. So in the next video, we'll take my randomly assorted cards and throw them at somebody else's randomly assorted cards. Alright.